Hi everyone, I'm Ejaris Dixon, the co-editor of Stories and Strategies from the Transformative Justice Movement. And under the age and kind of in the midst of this global pandemic around coronavirus, a lot of people are thinking about how do we use the tools of mutual aid, which really connects to the work that we've been doing around how do communities stay safe together? So how are we going to take care of each other um, around what's happening? We know we're in the midst of a government failure. We know that the odds are that we're going to have to support each other to get food, to get to the doctor, or to check on each other. Uh, there are some. There are two resources I wanted y'all to know about. There's one that's called Pod Mapping for Mutual Aid, and it's an adaptation of a resource that is in the book that we just put out um, around pod mapping. And the idea is defining who your relationships are and asking those people how you can support each other through those times. Then there's a whole outer layer when you look at the tool that will actually look at organizations that can be supportive. I would also love to shout out a, a toolkit that my co-editor, Leah Lakshmi Piepshna Samaran Singha wrote around a half-assed disabled preppers guide to surviving the the coronavirus quarantine. And it talks about a whole bunch of ways that you can not only prepare your household, prepare yourself, but take care of the people around you. We're the ones who are gonna take care of each other to survive these times. We won't be able to survive these times alone. So I really hope that you look at these resources and think about how will you support your neighbors, how will you support your loved ones, and start having those conversations now.